You're looking at Beaumont, Texas, still underwater, as you can see. It's been almost a week since that deadly storm hit, and we're seeing an incredible outpouring all across the country for those affected by Harvey. People have said that we're seeing the worst of Mother Nature and the best of human nature. And the staggering scope this morning, many people still stranded. The Coast Guard has rescued 9,000 people and 1,000 pets this week. Nearly 100,000 homes destroyed, and that number is likely to rise, and perhaps dramatically. Meanwhile, this morning, new fears. This is ominous. We're watching a major hurricane, Irma, intensifying over the Atlantic. All this as a new threat is what's left of Harvey is still causing so many problems. Let's go to our chief meteorologist, Ginger Z, with new possible flash floods. Ginger? Uh, Robin, I just got the numbers in from Nashville. 50 homes evacuated this morning, and the rain still falling north of you here. You can see the center of what's left of Harvey. Bowling Green, Kentucky, and the flash flood warnings this morning because Harvey is not done with us yet. Overnight, what's left of Harvey pouring on Tennessee. Up to eight inches of rain, shutting down Interstate 40 forcing evacuations and at least 25 water rescues. Emergency conditions. Uh, yeah, you can see somebody yeah, moving in the yeah, cab. About to this local Memphis TV crew taking matters into their own hands when they spot a car going under. Oh, good grief. That's a little girl. Thank God he got her out. Thank yeah. you, Lord. I had to back up. We got fires up there. A tornado in Pickens County, Alabama, wiping out homes, injuring four people. That tornado, one of nine reported in Alabama, Mississippi, and Tennessee. Already a half foot of rain falling in some of these places, especially in the area you see in red. But Lexington, Louisville, just south of Cincinnati, you're not out of the woods yet. Some of the heavy rains are moving toward you as we speak or are on top of you already. And actually, we'll eventually see along the East Coast some of the relatively lighter rain from Harvey through the weekend. That's Saturday night that you saw getting pretty wet there from Pennsylvania through New York. Quick look, more than a half foot. Hi everyone, Michael Strahan here, and I want to thank you for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. Now, if you would like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, all you got to do is click on the right over here, okay, right there, to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thank you for watching.